it's much better ice than this. I like our odds with the group we got of getting out. Yeah. We'll work hard. Well, even if we only lose one yeah. person, <laughs> it's not that bad. One is not bad. That's better than yesterday. Way better. Way better. That was a wonder. <laughs> okay. That was a wonder. That was a straight one shot. A one with that that light spud yeah, too. That was a one. Okay. Let's drill a hole right here. Okay. Drill, yeah. We'll drill it. You want to drill? I'll drill. Hello, Marco from Cast and Conquer here. We just found our first fish of the day. Big boy. Big boy. He's gone now. He's gone now. Why don't you guys have rods? Why don't we have rods? It's <laughs> <laughs> just like, what are we doing? What are we doing? <laughs> just so, guys. you guys find anything? Yeah, lots of fish, but uh, we just drilled holes We're and scoping. found them. And yeah. <laughs> what happened? It just slid out, right? I went to go turn because I saw the trail and I just turned way too hard. We got Mr. Alex Perrick putting on skates. We got Jay, we already came down earlier with the quad. Chiseled our way out, we're all wearing protective floater suits. Ice picks to get out and we spudded all around in the shallows here in about four or five feet of water. So we're gonna be targeting some stock trout. We're a little bit limited on to where we can go today, but we're gonna get some jaw jackers out. Alex is gonna go for a skate right now. We're gonna catch some fish, so enough dilly-dallying, enough blabbering. Look at this guy over there. Wise words, Perrick. First ice, 2023. Woo! Woo! That's exactly where I'm going to set up though, over there. Me too. I'm taking the two furthest ones, okay. unless you want to go further. Okay. I think it's going to get sketchy around the beaver hut. Yeah. All right, we got our live scope set up. I checked this hole here, and there was Oh, there's minnows in my hole. Live minnows. I got one. Nice. A little stickleback. Look at that little guy. So we checked this hole eight feet. I moved over there, nine. The weeds in this hole was all around, pretty much to the surface. Um, this one has weeds. Still kind of all around, but not as high. We're just gonna set our minnow just above that weed, like five feet down. 11 feet here. It's way deeper here. I got you, I got you, I got you. What is this? This is big. Dude, he came out of nowhere. And Whoa. Just smashed it. Oh, that jack jaw jacket went off. It might have been, no, it couldn't have been this fish. No. Dude, I just dropped. What do you think you got? A big rainbow, I saw him coming Is in, he was huge. Yeah, sounds huge. Good. Dude, he came from 10 feet away like a rocket. Oh, Jay's on. Oh, it's huge, I just saw it. Have you ever caught a big rainbow? Uh, like 23. Oh! This looked bigger. I'm just gonna go for the oh scoop. My I'm just gonna go for the scoop on the ice here, and just play them nice and easy. Oh my god! Oh, he's barely hooked. He's almost ready. He's almost ready. He's almost ready. Oh my god! <laughs> Yes! <laughs> you got him! It's a beauty! Oh my gosh, Let's look go. at that. Let's go, the lip smacker. That was five minutes of fishing. I almost butched that for you. Hey, he stayed pinned. I was wondering too, because I had like the small treble on. Gosh, that's an amazing fish. Yeah, here you go, buddy. Sick! Wow. I think that's a Manitoba master. Should I get them board for you? Yeah. He came flying in. <laughs> Wow, that's a beauty fish. Nice hen. 
Be nice if it was a buck, but beggars can't be choosers. First ice, first fish. Wow. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. 21 and 21. Yeah. And a quarter. Yeah, and a quarter. See you later, girl. Bye. Yes! Five minutes, not even. I gotta get back down there. My jaw jacker went off. Jay's got a fish. I caught a fish. Three minutes into the day, it's gonna be a good day. Now, could you quit splashing my words? Definitely a fish because it took my minnow. Got one. My first Manitoba brookie. You got a brookie too? Before not on this trip. Oh oh. I caught rainbow. Oh sick. Yeah yeah. Huh. It was a nice one. Let's see. Dude, my jaw jacker went off four times in a row and just kept taking the minnow. I put a new minnow on and dropped it and held it and it took three seconds. I thought we were gonna get like maybe five fish, five, six fish all day, mm -hmm. but it ended up like we have four fish already and Jay's Thanks. hooked up right Jay's now. Jay's got another big one. Yeah. Could I have kept that rainbow? Hey. Okay. Could you keep them? I think so. I didn't know if we were keeping, so I was just like, oh, I'll do the response. Why does everything just get tangled while ice fishing? Yeah. Are you getting this? This is some good content here. Mm -hmm. This is this is what we're looking for. There we go. All right, it's all working. Fish eats it. This is the key. You gotta just have little netty ones. I know, but then they get wet because yeah. you can't get them off when you catch a fish. What are you using? Just a micro dinner bell with nothing. Yeah, I just keep it moving. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Pull that. Um, do you want my abominable fish handling skills again? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Should I come very close? Yeah, you should. Ooh, it's another master. It's really big. Another trove? Oh, that's bigger than the last one. Alex, go get the measuring board. You're on skates. Okay. Look at that visual under the ice. Yeah, buddy. So beautiful. Those are fun, eh? Wow. There's so many fish here. You've been seeing a lot? Like, I've seen like six rainbows. I've had two brookies already. You caught them or? Yeah, caught two brookies. That's my second rainbow. Oh no, 20 and a quarter. Oh. Look at those fires real quick. Why? Skates are just so practical. Never done this before. No? No. I just had the idea when I was driving off. Because once it gets bumpy out, you can't really do no. it. No. And even too much snow, you can't do anything. So it's like, this is the time. I'd love to catch a big male. I caught a beautiful, like, 11 pounder. My One of my first or second fish ever when I was fishing Lake Michigan when I was 12. I'm like an automatic fisherman. I fished three days and caught one fish. A male? Yeah. Oh big, my gosh. Big. Uh, kite on it. Like here somewhere? Ooh, ooh. Nice fish, nice fish, nice fish. Oh, oh, oh. Nice fish. Nice. Might be bigger. Be a giant brookie. This is bigger for sure.
All right, I'm coming in for some commentary here. Here we have Andrew Walker from Cast and Conquer, hooked up on a beautiful rainbow trout. It's such a beautiful one. It's the biggest one yet, for sure. Beautiful bows. I love them. It's hard to compete with a fish of this caliber. That's a fat And one. this might be your third master of the day. We're fishing a yep. stock trout waters. And look, oh, oh, no. I tried to do the bass save. It didn't work. She's gone. That was the biggest one yet, for sure. <laughs> you need a bump? <sighs> She's gone. She's gonna go away slowly. <sighs> Another minnow. Looks so big under the ice, though. Get in there. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. I don't 22. know about you, but I'm feeling twenty-two. I don't know about you. What a fish! But I'm feeling twenty-two. All right, here we go. Going back. Going back. Oh, body! Piss and vinegar. Piss and chips and vinegar. Pass the salties. Invest in ice skates. Play it against sports. These are long ones. Yep. Oh, oh gosh. It looks a little small. Oh gosh, it's so big. Yay! Got the fish on the ice. Okay, on hooking. Going back. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> We ended up having a pile of rainbows, a few little brookies for myself. It's midday, so we're gonna wrap up this one and on to the next one. The fish are still biting like crazy. We're seeing a pile on live scope. The mini dinner bell, just getting it done in that lip smacker color in the smallest, smallest size. So we're gonna wrap up our gear here and plan for the next little adventure. See you guys on the next one.